What is up, Kraken Bass fans? Woo! Today I'm going to be walking through the float and fly. It's a lethal technique in the cold winter. Um, water temps in the 40 degree range, you can catch them on this thing. It also works all year round. Um, I've got a little secret way to do it where you can bomb it far and you don't need to get a special rod. Step one, put your, this is the bobber stopper line tie. You thread your line through there and then you pull off, you pull out this little black piece and leave the knot on your line. What I like to do is just cinch it somewhat tight so you can tie the rest of your rig on and then when you're done you tighten it even more with these two tag ends and then clip them off and then you can slide this up your line wherever you want it's such a small knot that it doesn't get stuck in your line guides when you're using a float and fly and then next is you put on a bead there's my bead thread it on there Next up is you slip on the float. You want a pencil style float that's fairly heavy so you can cast it farther. And then you have your bead, your knot, and your float. You just slide it up a little bit and then you're gonna tie on your fly. Tie on your fly, I just use a little polymer knot right at the base of your float. There you go, got the fly tied on there. This is a bluegill spro flat fat fly, one eighth ounce. Got the bobber, got my stopper. And now I'm just gonna slide this all the way up. I'm gonna go, I'm fishing really deep today. So I'm gonna measure out about, I'm gonna measure out 20 feet. This is crazy. And then I'm gonna tighten this up and snip these off and start fishing. So that's how you set it up. So if you can see that knot right here and it'll slide through those eyes really easily. There's the knot. And you just reel it down into your reel and now I can like suspend this thing at like 25 feet. You know, most float and fly guys will just like clip it on the line but this thing is super awesome. Bomb it out, see if we catch one. Big one, dude. Oh my gosh. Big one on the float and fly. Thing freaking works, man. That bobber just went down, suspending it out there at like 30 feet. Oh, he's not that big. <laughs> it's just been a long time. Middle of January. Yeah. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Suspending that thing out there off this dam at 28 feet. Yeah! Float and fly, baby. Woo! I've done this a lot. Such a fun technique. Wow. Way fun fish. I stuck him good too. These little flies will hook him. Yeah! Woohoo! Float and fly. Got him. I thought he was bigger, but. Okay, well, that's it for the float and fly. It's a great technique. Hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe and like and. Uh, 